Go. So in this video, uh, I want to show the difference between the two ends of a tandem mid-tube. So we make sure that those are put in the correct direction rather than backwards. Um, it's particularly important when you have a tandem mid-tube that has a cable running along it. We want to make sure that the cable actually uh, goes to where it needs to go and is the right length is how we set up the bike. But here behind this, this sleeve, you'll see that there are flat cuts. And so this can uh, this can expand and collapse basically to allow the tension on the timing chain to be correct. So those those made up and fit underneath the three bolt connector. Whereas on the other end of this tube, we're going to find a scalloped cut, a coked cut at the end of the tube that allows this tube to made up correctly with the. Um, front end of the bike. So when we were originally assembling this bike, this <laughs> coped cut should go as far as possible into the socket. And you can feel a really positive connection that that is in as far as it can go. Will you twist it again? Yeah. So like, as you twist it... I'm pushing it in, if I'm anything other than the right rotation, I can't go all the way, and then whoop, there it goes. So that's in all the way. And on the bottom, where this is even more important, we're going to have a coped cut just like the one we saw. I'll put those up side by side so we can visualize it. We're going to have a coped cut just like that so that this piece inserts all the way in and kind of wraps around the bottom bracket shell. And as long as I push that all the way in down there, then the tension on the cables, theoretically, then is exactly how it was set up at the factory. Anything other than all the way in, if it's turned a different direction with a twist or just not put in all the way, or if you tried to do your timing, uh, timing chain tension with uh, moving this, this uh, joint, then the shift and the brake cable tension is going to be thrown out of whack. Fantastic. Thanks. All right. Thank you.